is Lolly, and my name is Marcy. I'm a 43-year-old executive coach. I live in Sausalito, California, on a houseboat, which is where we are right now. And it's full of magical things like kayak rides to see sea lions, wild birds, and my vision is to connect nutrition to pleasure. And what we're going to cook today is an apple crisp that's actually good for you. So let's go. Come on. Slicing apples. You can use um, tart apples. You can use sweet apples. I like to, you know, if I've got a mixture, I use that. Otherwise, just, um, there's something really nice about the tartness combined with the sweet, with the salty in the topping. So the next thing we want to do is we want to add the kuzu root to the apples. So this is a really fantastic healing, it's got healing properties. So the next step is to add your nuts into a warm pan until all the oils are released. Now I used a medley of pecans and walnuts. And now we've got some pine nuts, which is an extra little twist that I have, but this makes it gluten free. And I'm going to add the apples right now to this kuzu root blend. And I'm just going to coat all these in here. Can you see? Oh my God, this is so delicious. What's great about this is it makes a really good um, breakfast too, the day after. We've got our, our baked cobbler. I added cranberries onto the top. And we're going to serve it up with some pomegranate seeds. So here's the uh, secret trick. You give your pomegranate a little spanking. And you can get the uh, pomegranate seeds ice cream, which is really just a blend of cashews, maple syrup, water, and a bit of salt. You can also use whipped cream. And then we're going to just top it with some pomegranate seeds. Let's give it a taste. I wish you were here. Oh, that's good. Mm. Oh my gosh. I love it with the crunchy pomegranate. Mmm. 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 All right. Let's go outside now.